delicious okay next time i guess i'll pick my phone up y'all i my eye be running so bad i don't know why it does that um it does that when i do makeup that's why i don't wear eyeliner but baby these lashes let me tell you julie nails y'all it's julie nails no i don't get my nails done now but i do get my lashes done yes y'all Check them out. They is full, baby. Tell me they not full. Y'all know these now. They is so cute. So I'm going to be on my way to go get my food. Hi, YouTube. As you know, I'm 5K. Welcome to my channel. Let's get into it, you guys. Today, I'm here with a mukbang. Yes, yes, yes. We have... Oh, it's been sweating. You know when the plate been sweating, it has sweat like it's wet or something. So I have catfish. I have two catfish and I have um, 25 shrimps. I like McDonald's fries with my, with my fish. So let me see if I can get the camera down a little bit, y'all, so I can get y'all into it. All right, I guess that's what it is. My head is not gonna be in the camera. I guess not. Let's see. I guess not. I guess not. If I sit over here, yeah, I'd be like that. Okay, so y'all know I'm a new, 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 newbie. I appreciate all my new subscribers for the ones that's just tuning in. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, uh, leave a comment. Things that you think that you want to see on the channel. Uh, things that you challenges send them my way. Yeah, we're taking on all challenges. Um, some challenges I know that we can't handle, like we that chicken, the Popeye chicken challenge. Oh my god, we had sucked at that. But I have um fried shrimps, fried fish, catfish, McDonald's fries, because that's the type of fries that I like to eat. I don't care what they say about McDonald's, talking like the fried fish. So, my favorite drink is Snapple's drink and Aloe Vera juice. So, I have these things. This this right here, it is delicious, y'all. My mom actually had left one of these here in my house. I say about a year ago, probably. My God. They got little centrals in here, like the pineapple. You know how the pineapple on? Um, they got little pineapples up in here. It is good, girl. Okay, y'all. Let's get into it. I got tortoise sauce. I actually got this fish and shrimps from... 
VIP seafood. VIP seafood. I'm not sure if that's College Park or Jones Barrel. I'm not sure, but they are real good, you guys. Mmm. What feel? Mmm. Everybody not everybody don't like catfish. Growing up, I didn't like catfish. I really didn't. But as I got older, because my mom always fr uh, fried trout. My mom always fried trout, y'all. Mm. I'm looking for some other soap. So y'all know I took y'all on my journey. Today, we'll at least try when I got my lashes done. <laughs> When I went and got my lashes done, y'all. When I went and got my lashes done, I just thought about, like, when I pulled up at the the, the, the uh, shop where I go, I thought about the guy that messed up my haircut. Let me tell y'all. I went to go get my haircut a little low. Some people know, some people don't. But I went to go get my haircut a little low. I had some pretty curls, blind with black hair. It was real pretty, y'all. I had pit my face and everything. I go in there to get my hair cut. Tell him I want it cut low. Don't worry about the color of the curls. Because the last barber was worrying about the color of curls. So they didn't go so low as I wanted to go. Right? This one went too low. I was like, I can't wait for losing. I'm going to go back wearing my bundles. Because I can't do nobody to cut my hair the way I want it cut. That bothers me, y'all. That bothers me. I had, I had one barber. And one barber be acting like he my husband or something. Like I, I didn't want to cut it. Um, it fits you real good. You look good. That's that's not what I asked you. I asked you how my hair look. I asked you did it fit me. I asked you not. I just asked you to cut it low with the girl table, the girl lining. But I had stopped going to him too because of that. You know? So I just be on a a man hunt for a barber. I would be on a man hunt for a barber too. If I'm paying you, give me what I need. Give me what I want. Right? So, your brother that I was telling you about a nail shop, when I said that boy had cut all my hair off, I didn't have no lining. I didn't have no edges. I didn't even have no hair on my neck. Okay? I know what you're saying. You're not supposed to have hair on your neck. I'm talking about, it was cut to up here, y'all. Up here. Your hair ain't supposed to be past cut up here. Your line is up right here. The, the shape of the back of your neck. So, that made me mad because I had tipped this guy, y'all. I had tipped him. And that made me so mad. Like, and they had, like, a stud, y'all. I had. A, I went by myself. I didn't bring my old lady. They had a stud, and she was laughing down in that chair over there where she was getting her hair cut. And I, and I just looked at her. All the while she laughing like the boy fucking up my hair. And y'all, when she walked out the barber shop, her lining was tight. Her hair color was tight. She looked real nice. When I walked out there, I looked as sick. <laughs> I looked as sick. And I wanted to post up. I wanted to post him so bad, y'all. 
But God has really been working on me. So I didn't post the man, y'all. So I passed that test. Because I used to be posting, going all. I'm going to react to person. Like, I'm going to react and I'm going to give you what you want. But I haven't been doing that. I haven't been doing that. You know what I'm missing? Bread. I eat bread with everything. I love bread, y'all. I love bread. No matter if they say bread blow you up. Bread make you fat. Oh, my children love bread. Um, they're supposed to be on a diet. Even when they're supposed to be on a diet, it's still, you know. Mm. I'm trying this fish up, y'all. It's so good. I'm trying to y'all. My, I'm going to tell you, my YouTube family, I really appreciate y'all. All the encouraging words that y'all be sending to me, it really matters. Because I know I'm not no pro. And I don't think you need to be a pro just to have a channel. Um, you know, I'm not trying to... Uh, Edit everything that you see. I want you guys to learn my personality for who I am. The flaws and all. Okay? So, that's why I don't get all dressed up to do a YouTube. And this is a question for people who do watch the video. Do you feel you need to... Do, do you feel the need to always be dressed up? When you shoot your videos, always casual, full makeup. Do you feel the need to be fully dressed, knowing that you just shoot your video? Now, for me today, I went somewhere, so I'm going to have clothes and stuff like that. I can see if you go somewhere, they can't even then you come back and do YouTube. I'm saying for the ones that just sit in the house. Do you think it brings more views to your channel by being dressed up? That's all I'm saying. Leave the um answer in the comments. Let me know. Do it bring more views? What? Now, I used to be the type of person, baby. I had to be dressed for everything. Everything had to be new. Bra, draw, socks, earrings. Now, everything just had to be new all the time. As you get older, I noticed I had to waste some money. $68 on nails. Oh no. I started budging, y'all. Let me tell you. When I started budging, I saw a change. A big old change. I'm telling you. That budget matters a whole lot. Okay? Um, It's crazy. I still be about that. Like, my nails was a bill. I know I'm not the only one out there that treated their nails like a bill. Like it had to be with the bills. It has to be done every month. Yo. Let me tell you about this pineapple aloe vera drink. It's so suitable. It's so, it tastes like when it go down, it's so breezy. So, it feel like you're actually eating on a fruit, but you're drinking it. It's Susan. I love it. I really, really do. And it's just a dollar. If you go to other stores, like the big stores, they charge you more than a dollar. And they got the big, big, big ones for like two sixty nine, dollars probably like $2.69. Yeah, it's so good. It's so 
So when y'all go to the store, try it and let me know. Leave it in the comments below. Yes. Below. Bro, that's how I be too, y'all. When I be drinking it, I try not to gawk it down, girl, because it tastes so good. And when it is um frozen, y'all know any drink that be frozen be good. I think I'm going to go get me some more piercings. I think. I think I'm going to go get me some more piercings. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Oh. This shit is good. This shit is good. Did y'all watch the video that I posted yesterday? If it didn't, make sure you do so you check out my crazy family. My family is so up. <laughs> my family is crazy. Okay. My family. Baby, my family is hit. I'm just. My family is hit. <laughs> they sleep this boy. You yeah, know them. Them is some cheese as well. They really are. Mm. So, let me try to tell y'all a little by myself. I want y'all to learn as I go. Everybody know I go by the name of 5K. Wah, 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 wah. All right. <clears throat> I have four kids. I have four kids with three left, if you get what I'm saying. Mm. I'm originally from New Orleans, Louisiana. Grew up in New Orleans, Louisiana. Born from New Orleans, Louisiana. Um, I got old lady teeth, y'all. So that's why I chew like that. I got old lady teeth. I got old lady teeth, baby. <laughs> so. I have an organization called, it's not called, it's called Horse of Ishmael. Horse of Ishmael feed the homeless and we also provide services to the youth. One of our, our first movements that I had started was Protect Your Kids movement. That was my first movement that we had started. The, the, 22, the 2020 movement will be Teens Don't Drive, Ride Bikes. That movement is to reduce fatal car accidents. We know our teens think they could drive. Drive, drive, drive. They really think they could just drive, right? We have some teens who do not own vehicles but still cars to drive. Unlicensed. Unsupervised. And really untrained. Okay? So, you know, Back in the days, we used to ride bikes. Whoever used to have a bike growing up, ride your bike to the corner store, ride your bike by your friend house, ride your bike at the pub. That's the type of way we was growing up, right? As these days, 
These kids know nothing about bikes. Soon they make an age. 14. I'm going to give it to 14. They feel like they could drive. Because they've been watching a mama drive. Unless somebody has already really let them drive. And we do have parents that let their 15 year old drive. Let the 14 year old drive. And we have some parents don't even know that the children know how to drive. And they're out there stealing cars and shit. And you get a phone call. Yes, your son has been stopped and he has been put in custody from a stolen car. And well, damn, I ain't know the baby. I ain't know the baby know how to drive. All the while, the other parent taught them how to drive. Catch that drift, okay? We'll talk about that another later. But that's one of the things that I will be pushing. So, in order to do that, the movement will have us providing bikes to the teens so they could get to school. So they could go by their friend house. So they could go to the store, right? If we encourage them that the bikes is healthy, they're safety for them, they live longer, and just show them the effects that it has on the body. I'm looking for something, girl, some sauce or something. I'm missing something. The effects that it really carries on the body. They'll like it, you know, but we as parents, we have to instill that in them because we're not doing that. We're not even thinking about buying no bike, you know, but I'm really going to um, push that movement. And I hope and pray that they do have other parents that feel the way I do and feel that we together jointly, we can reduce we can reduce the percentage of teen debt in car accidents. We can reduce that. And and, and and that's my goal, you know. Um that's my goal. Like I said, we go we feed the homeless. We do their makeup. I provide their wigs. I do their lashes. We do we feed them. You already know that. What else do we do? We clothe them. Pray for them. Whatever the conversation, whatever they need, we, we provide it for them. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, I do not give out money. I do not give out cash money. I do not. And I have a lot of people reach out to me about cash money. And it kind of not discourages me. It just makes me feel like Am I coming off wrong? Am I promoting wrong? You know, uh, what is what is what is the the why would people be thinking I would give out cash? Okay, it's not for everybody. Only people that think like that is people who are trying to get over. This new man need no light bill paid, no living living necessities. Need to be taken care of when it comes down to the people asking for money. Now, I feel like that they be testing me. But why test me if I'm a show and tell person? If you follow my social medias, you can see that I'm actually executing everything that I put together. And it's just not me. It's my team. My family is my team. But well, y'all know when I say I... I'm really saying team. You know what I mean? Some people don't get that. Some people like, she's saying, I, 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 like it's just her. It's not me. I just can't do it by myself. You know? But, um, we've been uh, established for two years now. It's true. This is about to be two years and some months. January? We about to be three years! <laughs> Three years in 
the game, y'all. That went by so fast. That go by so fast, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. It's January. Our anniversary. I have a you. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. And I really took, uh, I always thank Ishmael Crown Holders. I always thank them, man, because without them, I wouldn't be able to do this. Well, I wouldn't be able to do it. But with two guys, help continually support, encouragement, reposting, like, share, all that matters. All that matters. But I can't believe y'all. We've been in the game for three years. Ah. We've been in the game for three years. Ah. How they go? Yeah. We've been in the game for we've been in the game for three years. Mm. I'm excited to even say that, y'all. I'm so excited to say that. Oh, these napkins. I don't understand how these napkins got wet. I don't understand how these napkins got wet. So I went to McDonald's and I just noticed that I told them no salt on the fries. Look at these fries. They refried my fries. I don't know the camper. Look, they refried the fries and they got salt on them. Unless they picked it up with the <clears throat> the regular, you know, the regular little scooper thing, they already have salt attached to the thing, been sticking on it all day, and putting it in instead of using like some tongues or something, or using that basket. I used to work for fast food, y'all. Use the basket and flip it over to the thing. But I guess everybody not evil, girl. I am full, y'all. I am so full. Oh, excuse me. When I say I am full, I am full. Mm, mm, mm. But I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. I really, 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 really um like to spend time with you guys. I like to post videos. Um, I'm going to try my best to post one every day because I eat every day. So why not post it every day, right? Basically, I'm getting a concept of how to post YouTube and I'm learning from my YouTube family. I watch you guys' pages. I leave comments. I like you guys. I'm definitely going to interact with y'all more, you know, because y'all my YouTube family and I want to get y'all a whole lot more so i do appreciate that and we got so much to talk about as we grow right as we grow because every youtuber want to know what the other youtuber is really about you know we always we always want to know the other one personality right is she really cool is she really that way oh oh Sunsung got a nasty old attitude. Oh, I ain't subscribing to her station. So, this different personalities. I don't care if you got that too. And I'm going to subscribe, baby. I'm going to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I heard that they have people that subscribe. It's like people want you to subscribe to them, but don't want to subscribe to yours. So that's what I have been seeing too. But I don't mind because like I said, I'm learning. So I definitely want to subscribe and, and get into it with different people, platforms, and learn different things. Some of your content, I probably could put better. You know, use on my little platform and you can do the little content better, right? We're not in competition, but it does help me to grow my channel. You know, I'm not in competition with none, no one. I'm not a competitional person because I'm not about to go out there and buy me a... $700 pocketbook, bitch, because Sandy brought one. That's not how I am. I'm going to give me a lot of pocketbooks for them $700 into Sandy one. That's the type of person I am. But I, I talk all day. I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go. 
I tr I'll try to do a video in the evening when I'm ready to get off. So hopefully she will want to do one. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully she will want to do one. And if I can't get her, I get the other claim. Either diamond or Isis. Tell me which one y'all really like. Which one y'all would want to know more about? You know, because the girls, you know, I got a son. He's not here right now. So I definitely would love for y'all to meet him. And if you go down in one of my videos, you'll see my son and me did a YouTube video. It was on the carpet cleaner. Because I've been here for some years and my carpet was looking like who done did it. And I and I, I did good, but I know if I would have had a professional to do it, it would have been more cleaner. So, but to each his own. Toodles, like, subscribe, follow your girl. Ooh, 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 ooh. This was 5K. Get into it.